Hello and welcome. Today we are going to import, we're going to create channels, import a template, import a playlist, and associate a template as a rule to certain events in the playlist. So let's start by opening our configurations panel and creating a new channel. Now, this multi-channel starts with default channel. So if you create a channel and you don't import any channel settings, which is what we're going to do today, you're left with the default settings. So we're actually going to keep the default settings, but we are going to import a primary mapping table. This is our primary mapping table. It's an Excel file. Our channel code is 01, so we must ensure that the traffic channel name is 01. Very good. Let's just apply that. And we'll go to our primary mapping table. Now this is what you get from the default channel settings. We are going to import uh, our mapping table. And this is only going to have primary events because we're going to add our own secondary events in a manual fashion. So we're ready here. We can click OK. All right. Everything in multi-channel is done on a per-channel basis, so we select our channel and we're going to import our playlist, which was the example we saw before. As you can see, it's no secondaries. Of course, it goes off without a hitch. Multi-channel works wonderfully. And we can take a look at our handy dandy playlist. We see all the shows, but only primary events, no secondaries. So what if we want to associate a template to certain secondary events? For example, we have uh, a schedule that runs from roughly eight in the morning to almost nine o'clock at night. So we can create a rule that will associate a template to all the programs, all the primary events that occur between 11 a.m. and 1 p.m. First of all, we need to import scenes to create a template. Let's pick this one. Double click it. Yes, if you're curious about the details of how to do it, you can consult the user manual. There's a section called Importing Templates. It gives you all the instructions on what to do. And then we're going to create a rule. And this is everything you need to know about working with rules, defining them, templates, and conditions. We're also going to set a condition. It's all spelled out here. So let's actually do it. It's much more interesting to do than to read. Importing templates. Here we have an imported template. Very nice. Now, we want to go to rules. And we can either right click in the editing area and add new rule, or we can be lazy and just drag it in. We have a new rule. So we can change it, the title. I think we're not going to do that today. We can also set conditions which is edit the conditions for rule, right click on it, and we're gonna add a condition. So we have our begin time. You do have other options here, but we're going to just use begin. When the begin time is greater than 11 o'clock. Eleven o'clock, very good. Let's add another one. But the begin time is less than one o'clock. Thirteen hundred hours. We're going to associate this template, which is an imported scene from Bizartist as we know. There we go. Now let's go to our playlist. We have to re-import it. This is a manual import. See the result. So there we go. We're going to do our manual import. No secondaries in this playlist until 
the rule is run on it and successfully imported, no surprises there. Let's take a look. And what do we have here? Between 11 and 1, we have our template, which is associated as a secondary event. It's that easy.